I'm good, how are you? Your coach just said, we should ask you, like, what's, what's the biggest change? What's the biggest change that Fish has made here? Uh, I think uh, the strength staff. Uh, personally, I think they they changed me as a, uh, they just got my body right, you know. Uh, the strength staff, they're doing a great job in there. You know, just recovery, because, you know, I was banged up in the spring. You know, they helped me a lot. And so they just made sure that I got my hamstring right. And so, yeah. Is that what it was? It was a hamstring? Yeah. Mm -hmm. In what ways have you noticed the bigger frame help you as a running back? Uh, just finishing runs, you know, falling forward. That's the main thing. Uh, one of the running backs that I get it from in the league, you know, Ezekiel Elliott, he always practices finishing forward, just running through contact and stuff like that, breaking arm tackles and all that. So, yeah. Uh, it felt good, you know. I haven't went full contact in a while, so it, it felt good to really get back on the field and just to feel it again. And you know, like just that feeling just got me kind of jittery, you know, just just missing it. Are you bigger than you were? Are you last yeah. Um, do you weigh more? Uh, like eight or eight or eight or ten pounds more. Huh. Okay. And do, when you watch film of yourself from last year, did you feel like you weren't falling forward all the time, or you weren't uh, going through tackles as much? No, it's not. Well, yeah, I feel like I was finishing runs. I just want to, you know, create more just yards after contact, stuff like that, just breaking more tackles. What did, what did you learn from uh, Gary and JJ working with them in the past? Uh, just being a professional. Those guys taught me a lot, especially just the mental part of the game, just being calm, relaxed out there, you know, pretty much just being an overall better running back. Your position coach never fumbled in his entire NFL career. How much does he emphasize ball security? A lot, a lot, <laughs> a lot. What does he say? Like what? Uh, you know, he always talk about the four pressures of contact, you know, just the wrist, bicep, chest. And then just the last one is just the mental, you know, just mentally it's just you just can't fumble. That's the main important part about just not fumbling. What does he say to the uh, He tries not to, you know, get too mad or yell, but, you know, you can – kind of feel that tension he has of just fumbling. You know, you just kind of don't want to do that. I mean, just, yeah, you can just feel it. Has he changed your technique at all as far as exactly where or how you carry the ball? Uh, Just kind of the same, you know, just keeping the ball high and tight. Okay. Um, you uh, played the most that you ever did last year um, you know, on a per game basis. What did you learn from that experience, would you say? Uh, just getting a lot more burn just helped me become more relaxed out there, you know, more comfortable. Just, yeah, just being more comfortable will make the team a lot better, so. so do, you do you sort of relate to what uh, Stevie Rocker and James Bowles are going through as new guys? Yeah, you, you know. In that position not that long ago? Yeah, I, at first they're going to struggle a bit, but once you get more comfortable and just get more experience and just got – getting more plays and reps, you, you slowly you kind of get there and you get to that level where me and Drake are and, and Bam and some of those guys, you know. So they, they're there now, though, maturing, especially Stevie. He's maturing a lot better. Why do you think it's been easy for Stevie to mature and play as big a role as he has? Uh, just the guys in the room, RB group, you know. I can't, I, I can't uh, say anything bad about anybody in our group. You know, I love our group. You know, friendly competition, like, competition like Coach said, you know, just helping each other out, being a, a good teammate, just being that, that friend that, that, that he needs and that James needs and that everyone needs. So as far as the overall program goes, what do you think is like the most positive change that Fish has made? Uh, just that it's personal, you know, getting that, that edge that, you know, because last year, you know, it didn't go our way, but now it's more of a positive mindset. The culture's in a positive direction, you know, that's that's all the ingredients for, you know, a winning season. Did so. you sense that right away, or did it take you a while to kind of understand and believe what he was preaching? Uh, I sensed it right away, especially through him and T.O. So yeah, they kind of T.O. brought that Bama mindset. So yeah, I sensed it right away. Last one here. Right. Thank you, Michael. Mm -hmm. Thanks.